Can you smell it? The smell of loot. I love the smell of loot in the mornings. Actually, it's like mid-afternoon. But, uh, whatever. Let's jump into another day of vigor. Pop up number one. Is there another one? Nope, daily login. Alright. How's everyone doing today? Good, I hope. Um, how am I doing? Glad you asked. Pretty good. Because I uh, jumped on YouTube to get ready to... Well, I've already uploaded my next video, but I've got to create a thumbnail for it and add all the chapters and stuff. So if you ever want like to find your way through anything you might find interesting in my videos, you can check out the chapters or find something you saw earlier and go, oh, what, what, whereabouts in the video was that? Check out the chapter titles. It might give you a hint. Anyway, I jumped on there, and I've hit 100 subs. 101. Went from 99, I think, yesterday, up, up to 101 today, so the big 100. I didn't think I'd ever get there. But this channel it really is starting to get rolling, and I really appreciate it. So, this gift is for you. I can't give it to you, but do you want some frostbite? On your face and your nose? No, probably not. I'll keep that for myself. Frostbite face paints or frost nip. Or maybe I'll whack it on when I'm out in the snow. What does that uh, fall under? Is that a separate category to facial uh, coverings? Do they have a face paint section? And check that out. Before we do that though, yes, 100 subs. Wow. I can't believe it. Um, it's cool. Like, it's like now I actually feel like people are watching my videos and I think they're pretty entertaining, if I do say so myself. And other people are starting to check them out and hopefully you share them around and um, I can get this channel growing more and more with your help. It's pretty awesome. I mean, I'm, I'm putting myself out there <laughs> in all my dorkiness. And uh, if people are liking it, it's pretty cool. What am I doing? Where are we going? Sagbrook, Phil Canton, Anakin. All right, so we're going to check the dailies to see where we need to go. Use three bandages in encounters. That's a wrap. Cold-blooded. Kill ten opponents in shootouts. Nope. Pedal to the metal. I oh, got this one again, man. I feel like every time I jump on, the daily says collect 400 metal parts lately. <sighs> okay. Depending on how rare they are, I might be able to get that one out in the next three and a half hours <laughs> and consume any pills ten times. Okay. We've got some here we can do. I mean, double dosage, consume any pills, tend to... Don't, 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 don't double dose. That's dangerous. Hmm, let's start off with a good old Sagbrook uh, run. What do you reckon? I think it's a good idea. I might just take in a gal. Good old gal. Hang on, hang on, 29 damage versus MGV, but the muzzle speed on that is insane, the rate of fire. I'll take in the gal, just do it. There's no uh, daily challenge requiring a certain weapon to be used. So, take him whatever I want. I'll start one of those crafting. Take one in. Bandages. And pills, wasn't it? Um, I'll take in a caffeine and an iodine. Sagbrook. Sagbrookian. Dude looking pretty deadly with his Uzi on his hip. Let's get changed. Yeah, actually, I like the idea of the, just the leather gloves and the leather jacket and the little goggles with his Uzi. That'll do us. 
Got to the rat trap before it overfilled. Probably not this one. Yep, just. No food wastage. And then there's some needy people down the hill. Counting on us. Hey! So we've got to help them out. For the main reason that if I don't, the bastards will probably want to come up here and take it for themselves. So I need them to stay down there. Alright. The little bastards can stay over there. I mean, you sorry poor folk can stay over uh, Good luck to you. I'll bring some food later. Oh crap, we're going in. Um, oh good. I'll grab that stuff when we get back. Sagbrook. I probably shouldn't have taunted the guys down the hill, guys and gals. Because, um, yeah, I mean, I keep sending them all this food. It's kind of like, uh, I'm trying to let them know that I'm here, I'm here to help you when you need it. But if I send them food at the same time, they know I've got food. That bastards will probably come up the hill when I'm gone. You know? Fine line. <laughs> Who are we in here with? Nobody I recognise. I don't think I've ever seen reptile over here. Ireland. What's he bringing in? Ooh. And he likes to travel around a thousand kilometres. Yeah, that guy could be dangerous. We've got a fair few people coming in. Oh. Hmm. With nothing. Oh, uh, we got some scary looking dudes. So, use a bandage from fall damage. Try and use my iodine pill late. It's raining, which will disguise our movement, which is good, but it also works in their favour, so, which isn't good. It's all going to come down to the spawn here. It's all going to come down to this spawn. Where are we at, Romero? Which which road did you take? It seems like there was a blockade up the road somewhere. Oh, I know what it was. Probably a mudslide. Definitely in Sagbrook. It's wiped the road out. A bit late. It's a nice spawn. I like it. I do like it. Got the goggles on, which is good. It's going to keep that rain out of our eyes. No, I'm not claiming my uh, seasonal challenge. I want to see if I get more for it with double XP. Thanks. First thing, I'm going to check the shed. Spawn right next to the bloody foreman's house. Here we go with the taking the wrong way around again. Blick, 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 blick. I should go the opposite of my first star. Like I said, the rain will work in their favour too, so. shouldn't I? The first thing I'm going to do, is this going to surprise you? Oi! Oh, you bloody cash key. First thing I want to do is jump out the window, take some fall damage, so I can actually use my bandage before I die. Get that bandage ready. Do I have a contact bomb or anything I can lay down in? Damn. No, look. Bloody, it, multiple cash keys in the same building. So annoying. Damn, if that was a red crate. I have not seen a red crate in Donkey's Yonks, and that's what I was hoping to see right there. 
two blue boxes in one location. Is there a third spot right here in this small little area? Someone could use a portable go all up in Therese. Alright, I'm out of here. Jam out blocked an incoming signal. Jammer blocked another one. Yeah, my, the problem with the jammer is someone might push because they think, oh, no one's up there. They could be down the road right now. Go, oh, no one's up there and they push. And I don't want them to push. Go, oh, I've got that loot up there to myself. No one's there. Breath back, you idiot. I'm overloaded. I mean, I could stay and go for the cash, right? Yeah, right. I need to see because this bush is too big. I can't see crap. Go, 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 go! Don't shoot me in the back, you bastards. Use that caffeine pill. I didn't realize this exit was that far away. Down. Someone's going to be really disappointed when they head there and all that stuff's gone. They're going to get there and go, oh, with two blue boxes and they're both empty. It's all mine. My precious. Little loot goblin. It's me. That is a great way to start the day. Spawn next to the foreman's house with no one else spawning on top of me. Sorry, I gotta stop stay saying spawning. Come on, let's add some realism. I um, took the road that led me to the foreman's house. Slowed down by a mudslide, but we got there. And uh, no one came that way. So I didn't have to fight over the loot, which was good. Did I remember to use that bandage when I jumped out the window? Did I? Did I? Because when, I, when I've got a pocket full of loot and a bag full of loot, everything becomes a blur. It's like, then I'm like, I just start going, quick, gotta get out, gotta get out, gotta get out, and I don't even know if I use that bandage. I did. Okay. Didn't use the pill, but we got out with it, so it's all good. I just wanted to be able to uh, check off that bandage one at least. I suppose I don't want to panic, and I could have just took it into this one. Loot. And a nice little Vinterez that I forgot I put a little snowy skin on. Do I test my luck back at Sagbrook again? Um, or go to Anakin like a fool huh where do you want to go Romero you want to try Anakin with all those locked exits why okay okay um, better get rid of this stuff first eh man do I take in the Vinterez risk losing it might as well uh, get rid of the monkey mine. Oh, you know the rule if we go on Anakin, we might get that lighthouse spawn and somebody's gonna bloody come there anyway when they ping you. So, I'm gonna take a few of these bad boys. Okay, bandage. Probably don't need that many pills. Although. It would be nice to actually hang around late. Baby, that's the plan. And try and get the center of the map checked off. It would be nice. Maybe take a transmitter to throw people off. Alright, calm down with the loot, alright? The consumables, you, you go on him too much. Then you're going to stand still because you're going to be afraid you're going to lose it. Going to have like a paralyzed... Um, I don't know what the word is I'm looking for. Alright, let's, uh, get 
changed. Got to get this gear on. Not your anorak, you want to stand out like a sore thumb. So where's this frost nip? I got the combat respirator, I'll whack that on, you're not going to see anything. Where's the, uh... Where's the frost nip? Outfit. Gloves, backpack, headgear, outfit. Archetype, mail three, outfit sets. Prepper, headgear sets, fleece cap, gas mask. Uh, backpack, gloves, face wear. It's not in there. Hang on, maybe it's here. Wind mask, nope. Jock strap face. Uh, frost guard goggles, headwear. Out. Is it a headwear? Nah. It'd be headwear. Face paint. Do you have to actually go into your like uh, customization of your dude here and change his look? Ah, oh, you do. Okay. That's how you change your face paint. Oh, okay. Alright, we're going to get some frost nip going, even though I look like a mime. <laughs> um, because we're going to be hanging around for a while. If we ever get there. Probably get a bit of frost nip. Who knows, maybe while we're there we'll stand on an iceberg. Practice our mime skills. Well, I saw a dude practicing his mime skills the other day. If you've seen that video, you probably know which guy I'm talking about. He was uh, doing a pretty good mime impersonation of someone who would be in anti-gravity. I mean, it's the best mime I've ever seen. He was doing a real good anti-gravity. Like he was just there floating in space. Radiation got him because of it, but... It was pretty cool. I wonder if I'll ever get rid of these rats for good. Damn, do these things have like glint? Look at this. Should I be wearing these? They probably stand out too much. People just see me in the distance with these things on. I remember there was uh, one map was a mire and where I was crouched down in a bush about to head towards some loot area and some guy comes sprinting through past me and he had some uh, what looked like night vision goggles or something but his eyes were red they, so they had to be some kind of night vision goggles and if it wasn't for his red eyes I probably wouldn't have been able to lock onto him so easy as he was sprinting past me Judges the two red eyes gave him away these bloody things going to give me away. Not too bad out here. I just like the way they look. They're cool. Come on, Anakin. We're counting on you. Yay! Anakin. I wonder if there is a spawn right in the center of the town and it's just really rare. I mean, I got a good rare spawn that I needed, well, rare for me, yesterday, to uh, bring help to those that are looking to get away from the family in Deverg. <laughs> um, it'd be nice if I can get this little, uh, if there is one, center of Gnome Town spawn. Jeez, everyone's in a hurry. I think we spotted the guy that's going to sprint around the map. Not bother looting. Oh, there's another one. Yeah, uh... Bohemia, you didn't really fix anything by locking all the exits. So I think you just made it harder for us poor bastards. The actual looters. Because the other guys still don't give a crap. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Oh look, the Bard House. I'm going to lose my Vinterest if I run there for sure. I want to be in here, man. Can I get the spawn close to that would be nice. Uh, we have a little area over here that's pretty useless. I might be able to... Why, why did I squeak just then? Get a little look at somebody over the hill here. It is dark. Who could be coming up on me? There could be someone coming around from my right. Can 
Okay, Glinty McGlinterson, I've got to remember. For some reason, games think it's a good idea to add Glint. So for anybody that actually wants to try and snipe. I'm just going to tell everyone where you are. Whether you like it or not. <laughs> I need to know where that is. Because I reckon someone's going to sprint to that before they go to the other thing. Is there a spawn over here near this building? Probably, right? And I can't lay up here on the hill like I was going to. It's the Aurora Borealis. Because someone will see me from that uh, house there. Kind of inexperienced at uh, this style of play, can you tell? Jesus. Let's just get some loot. Maybe there's a red crate. This thing has auto, doesn't it? Let's put that on. Where is that bloody thing? On the ship, okay. Hard safe. I'm pretty sure that's who I sh heard shooting. There's people trying to hit that. I need loot because I've got to be able to get out. There's no point just uh, trying to get to the centre of town if I'm not going to get some loot first. This is something the killers don't do. I'll take your loot from your cold dead hands. Yeah, sure, stick all the fuel over here. Well, we know where this wants me to go. The other side of the bloody map. I just saw another one. Where does it say it? It's up here. Don't set off your own explosive, you idiot. Like, it wants me to go over to the fuel exit. Which there are two of. Maybe I push down that way. The signal detector's right there, of course it is. What a shame it doesn't spawn like move like the com stations do with the uh, airdrop. Teleport the signal detector somewhere else, please. Okay, comm station is going to have already been hit by now. Let's worry about someone, you son of a... Great. Okay. They know where I'm at right now. They're going to head this way. I bet it's a psycho dude. And he doesn't have far to run either. He's just going to come straight across here. Safe's already been here, right? So maybe I just run, come around wide, head to the centre of town, rather than try and get this uh, 
I look at this bard safe. How am I stepping on twigs? How am I stepping on twigs? Sorry, I just had to stop and look at the moon. It's the uh, lone wolf in me. No interest in the bar, uh, bard house. No interest. I want to get over here. Hoping whoever's hit the safe is left. So that I can go towards the center of town while there's nothing really over there. Um, oh, you. The airdrop's over there. I want to hit these areas so bad. They're like little beacons to my explorer brain. Someone's got a jammer. Not mean it. Where are you, dude? See, I shouldn't have that information. That's kind of, uh... That makes it too easy. Okay, that's the... So that's someone in the bard house right now. getting shot at by someone right here. The plane is near. Ada. Get ready for the airdrop. Ada. Seriously, now? someone else trying to push through the ship to get him dude where are you He's gone quiet, I'm nervous. Could be coming around behind me right now. I hear something. Oh, time switches. There's time switches here. Oh, well, that was for the safe. Alright. Well, that was fun. 
I hate when you can hear someone shooting and you can't see where they're at still. Like everyone's freaking invisible. We are stuck. How many electronics do I have? No, we're not. We can get out here. radiation pills there are people still over there fight he's serious Marking these bastards off. That's my goal. Two. didn't accomplish anything else, I accomplished that. Finally. I'm going to stop and loot stuff, but I, I want to make sure I'm actually going to get to this exit. And I know there's um, people down the other way, so... That's why I didn't go for the fuel one. Oh man, the lure of loot, man. Like, you don't know how hard it is not to just stop and want to grab that stuff right there. Run, you idiot. Gotta actually start the engine of the boat. And this guy decides he wants to run out of stamina. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's get out of here. Eh. That happens to me all the time, man. I will hear pop, pop, pop. And I'm like, where is this guy? Try and creep a bit closer. Because I know the footsteps in this set game, man, they can hear you coming from a mile away. So I'm like, creep a little bit closer. Where is he? And he's sitting there shooting and shooting, and I never lay eyes on him. They're always like ghosts. Use some pills for the daily. Bloody Anakin ghosts strike again. In my mind, I'm like, I stand out like a sore thumb. People are going to see me coming from a mile away. They're going to see me if I try and creep across the snow here. They're going to... And, and I'm dead. I try and creep up on somebody, I can't see them. Maybe I'm more invisible than I think. I suppose that's like that's the advantage of high ground, right? Because if you're higher than me, then I can't see where you're at until I basically get right up to his level. I've got to snake around, creep, creep, creep up until I, you know, and right near the dude. If he's sitting at a nice, like the highest elevation in that little area, 
which he was, I've got to get up high enough to be able to see him. I should have climbed up, which I thought about climbing up on the shipping containers. The ones near where I laid that uh, contact bomb, thinking he might try and come back through here. I think, do I climb up on these? Jump up, and I can see where he's at. I just didn't, I thought, uh, if I do that, as soon as I climb up on one of these bloody things, it's going to make a noise. Clong, clong, clong. And um, whoever's at the bard house or this guy is just going to see me standing up on a bloody container. And uh, I keep telling myself, like, in that situation, when they don't know where you are, he has no idea I'm there. Okay? I need to push forward more, a little bit more aggressively. Not sprint at him, that's not what I do. But at least... He doesn't know you're there yet. Stop playing like he does. Alright, start push forward a bit faster. Till you can see where he's at. Instead I lay there and think, nah, I'm going to give away my location. And then... I never get eyes on the dude. Or he turns around and comes back my way and sees me. And then in that situation I'm going to lose a gunfight. So... I've got to be more aggressive with my push, not ultra aggressive, just to move a bit faster, somehow. Patwank, now tell me about my seasonal challenge, yep, and then pop it up on the screen at the top there. I've got to ask someone about this. Do I get double XP for seasonals? If I um, save collecting my seasonals for when I've got double XP. I do new. Uh, yeah, that was a bit of a busted run. <laughs> um, I think we put away the snow gear, and we head to Myron. That's what we're going to do. i got a few of these A74K SUs, Scooby-Doo's, we'll take in one of these, and uh, head to Myron. I gotta use pills though, don't I? Still gotta use more pills. Oh, taking the old jammer. Craft one of them while I'm gone. So it'll be ready. And um bandage, yeah, I'm taking one of those. Taking a caffeine pill. Iodine pill. Myron. Cause I've actually I've still gotta do some more pills, don't I? Yeah, gotta do six more of those. Metal parts, I forgot I'm collecting metal parts. Let's get changed. Oh, there we go. Taking this gas mask. I heard the wind is going to be pretty strong today. On the ham radio, so... Might blow that radiation in quicker. Take that gas mask, we should be okay. Shut up. I didn't collect the rest of this stuff, did I? How's the toilet problem going? Yeah, still haven't fixed that properly. Three shells. <laughs> oh, hey! Let's go get some metal parts. Got like another 300 of the bastards to collect, so... Stay focused all this uh, XP, any bonus XP you can get, it's going to help out get these coins from the Warlord season. Myron. Romero thought he might head there to find some metal parts. I say stick to the bunkers. The trenches. Stay away from the POIs. Unless... You're feeling brave enough. You mean unless I spawn right inside one? I'll go for a barb safe. I mean, it does happen. What have we got, 11 people? 12? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. One might come in late. Green, 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 green. Ah, oh, damn. I saw some badges, so I thought, yeah, it's not all going to be green. It's not all going to be smooth sailing. 
dude. Come on in with a combat magnum. Alright, we're gonna just be a little careful. Be a little bit careful of these guys. And, uh. There's only two scary looking dudes, really. Might be able to get something if I spawn close enough. Start bringing in an adrenaline shot every now and then, especially when I come to Myron. Myron seems to have a higher rate of green coat activity. If I can bring in an adrenaline shot whenever I come here and at least sprint to something good. Yeah, where am I? Okay, damn. Near any bloody thing. Got these uh, buildings here with two comm stations. Sprint to the time safe. Um, maybe. Maybe I just go to the comm station right now. Get some loot out of there. Maybe find a red crate. Use a stealth. Someone probably spawned down close to the... Okay, I'm hearing shots already. Is, let's slow down by running through the frickin' muck. You stupid f Funny guy. This building reminds me of the buildings you see in Tarkov. Shut the door. Well, they call it dorms. Is it downstairs? It's downstairs, isn't it? It's downstairs. Yeah, it's downstairs. Maybe it's in this one. Ah, oh, it's downstairs. Damn it. Of course it's downstairs. It's always downstairs. Uh, we are gonna... Oh, you son of a... Yeah, I think you tried to give me a wave, but dude, you sprinted up on me. Don't sprint up on people. Makes me nervous. Alright. I think he went to give me a wave. You can't be sprinting up on people, bud. Don't answer the phone. You just can't be sprinting up on people and hoping that they don't kill you, alright? Uh, like, you slow down a bit. Slow down a bit. I know there's another time safe, I mean a comm station in this direction, so they might come this way. I apologise, I really do. Just, you freaked me out a little. A bit too eager. I might go back and see what the guy's name was. Yeah, just a little bit too eager with the uh, introductions. I can't. I've already took everything out of his box. Reload. Always reload. That's something else I've got to remember. If you want to introduce yourself, you, you, you do it before you come in the bloody door. Um, just give a little hey! It reminds me of Dawn, so I've never played Tarkov myself, as I've said before, like I've tried. My PC just says, no. I was not built for this level of game. So I haven't upgraded it in the last probably five or more years. Um, do I risk going up here? Boo. Anyone want to shoot me in the head? Anybody? Anybody? Nobody? Nobody wants to shoot me in the head? Hey, Gemma blocked an incoming signal. I like it. I like it. 
I don't want to be up here, I don't have a sniper rifle. <sighs> Damn man, I don't have another Healy heal. He didn't have any. I think he's only a low level dude. Oh, the cash spawned right there. Alright, someone might already be out there grabbing that if they were hit that other building with the comm station. So I don't know if I want to go out there right now. This little doodad. Nice looking little hutch there. Oh, that's right where the cash is, isn't it? Damn it. I think he's got my cash. gave away your location. I think he's over there getting the cash. He's got to be. Right? It's just coincidence. How do I feel about that kill? Yeah, not great. The guy made me nervous. Uh, yeah. Just anxiety. The way he sort of sprinted in there just, just made me a bit jumpy. Cash is right here somewhere. Maybe he didn't get this cash, but he's in that building there, I think. Oh, I hate how these things are so hard to bloody see. Especially in the dark? Holy crap, man. I really wish I could see where this guy was at. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. The plane is coming. Prepare to fight for the airdrop. Oh, what did they destroy that? Too late now. Don't destroy uh, fertilizer, dude. That's valuable stuff. I was hoping to find a red crate. We looked around. No red crate, okay. You got some good stuff. Damn, that eggs is going to be camped. Holy crap, it's going to be camped. Time safe. Airdrop. Dude. Okay. We brought a gas mask for a reason. Might be going to have to use it. Unless I go up north, signal detected, exit. 
barred house has probably already been hit for sure. That's my favourite little spawn spot there, and they've left. Um, pushing south is dangerous because I've got to go through this. That's probably my best bet for an exit. Uh, I'm going to do it now. I've got to do it now. I've got to do it now. Cannot carry any more stuff. There's just so many little bushes for people to be hiding in. Like this military camp, I've had um, misfortune trying to push through there before. <sighs> I think I had north and chance going at that exit. I don't like. I don't like the idea of pushing to that. full of loot. I've got a lobby full of green coats that might be pushing the same way I'm pushing to try and avoid trouble. And I've got two radiation pills so I'm going to use them. That's what I'm going to do. Alright, I've got all this stuff. Okay, I've got crafting bits for armor plates. Radiation grenades. Seasonal is usually for crafting radiation grenades. I want out. Also want some bonus XP from hitting this. <coughs> did I use a, like a caffeine pill and then just crawl along on the ground? I did, didn't I? I'm going to head north, and uh, why are you going for that blue box that somehow sometimes spawns up there, bud? Why? I'm going to use this. Because someone might pop that signal detector late. Like, if I go to this building that has a blue box in it, I can't carry anything else out. I think it's over that way further anyway. Here it is here. This is the one, isn't it? I think it is. Yeah. There's some fertilizer usually just there. Sometimes there's a little combination log box. Right. Like I've said in a previous uh, encounter, this exit is bigger than you think. 
And if it is being camped, hopefully it's being camped from the other side. But they're gonna have to stay into this radiation for a long time, hoping someone's gonna come this way. I really don't think there's anyone over here. They would've used the signal detector by now. They're camping those other exits. I mean, everyone's probably gone. They're all green coats. No one's camping anything. See, I can... The other side of this exit is all the way over there amongst those trees. It's a, it's a further distance than you think. So... It's a tough one for someone to camp, is what I'm saying. They can camp one side of it, but you could just go to the other side. And usually the other side is where it's going to be camped, surely, because that's the side of uh, all the loot. That little farmstead family estate, whatever it is over there. I'm sorry, bud. Next, if you want to say hi... Say hi before you come in the door. Otherwise, I'm just going to assume you're a trespasser. Okay. Um, it just made me a bit nervous. Definitely glad I took him, like, is that some kind of AK? I'd like to thank uh, the guy in the comments that said... I, I'm bad with names. Okay, I apologise, I don't know your, your name, whoever said this. Look, I'm just really bad with names, always have been. Someone tells me their name, and it's, it's like, it is a condition. Like, I've heard, like, Stephen Fry even say he has the same condition. Stephen Fry, like, a famous British comedian. Um, until he said that it's an actual condition and that he suffers from it too. It's like, someone can tell you their name, I don't know what the condition is called, and it doesn't retain like you just uh, someone can introduce themselves to me and it just whew, I, the name doesn't stick faces stick for me um names don't so anyway the guy in the comments that said take in because they're easy to craft they're easy to get your hands on an ak and i think that's pretty much what that is right it's an a74 ksu and it looks like an ak I swear I saw his little hand go up like it. He was about to say, hey, and then I shot, and he's like, and then it was too late for him. I've been there, buddy. I've been there. Many, 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 many. Go watch my videos. Many, 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 many times. <laughs> I've been there. It sucks. It sucks. Just give me a little shout before you come in next time. Call first. People that don't call first. Nothing worse. Where are we going? How many of them dailies did I get done? I need one more bandage and three more pills. And we're getting there with the metal parts for a change. I like it. I like it a lot. And these jammers, they're working for me. And I have the ability to craft them now. So it's a good thing to block those portable detectors. One more bandage. I've got to stop chewing through these iodine tablets, so... Oh, that's what they're there for. Take one in. Okay, okay. What are you taking antibiotics for? Maybe it counts as a pill. I don't know. Try it out. I don't think it does. I think it's a liquid. Um... That's there. Do I dare? Do I dare? You know what? No. No. You know what? I, I want a nice day of not go onto any battery maps. Now they've made Snow Decked as bad as Draug. No battery maps today. Okay. You had your fun at Anakin. It's the most dangerous map now, probably. And you, you took a risk. But no more. Go to Kirsten. Not today, okay, but I know, I know. See, it's too dangerous. And I just don't know if I can take it today. <laughs> just one day without a battery map. And then maybe I'll do a day of just all battery maps. I'll wait until Snow Deck or uh, Drow come up with 40 minutes on it, and I just go in, requeue, go in, requeue. You know what I mean? Go in, get out, requeue, go in, get out, requeue. 
we'll do like a day of all battery maps, including Anakin pretty much falls into that category now. I'll just do, I don't know why I'm going to do that to myself. It might not be a very long uh, day of vigorant on that day. It might not be a very long day of vigorant on that day. But we'll try just an entire, dude, you did get some snow bite. Frostbite, snowbite. You poor bastard. You stayed in Anakin too long. I told you that was going to happen. <sighs> yeah, well, um. Yeah, I don't know why I'm going to do that to myself, but we'll do it. Just a whole day of uh, locked exit maps. Let's see how that one goes. Maybe I'll do that tomorrow. Depending on the daily challenges. Kirsten. Oh, Romero, you should have heard the funny things he was saying last night about wanting to do a, an entire day of traveling to locations that have locked exits and locked borders. I think the guy's finally losing his mind. Not that it was ever there in the first place. Great. Vampiro. Dude, it's hard to pretend you're a green coat when you wear that badge. You really? Really? You only fool in like actual green coats with that. Oh, okay, here we go. Here's a team. I'm telling you. This is another map. I saw it like a yesterday I played in a lobby where everybody was wearing a military vest. Except one girl she was wearing, but she was wearing like a general uniform camouflage or something. There are people that come in as teams. I, I suppose we all know this by now, but these two, I've never seen that hat, and bam. <laughs> but I would not be surprised if that guy's with them as well. I don't think I've ever spawned up here. Oh, uh, maybe once. I remember going to Biff Manor one time. There's probably another spawn spot, like, right here. Let's just hope one of those guys isn't purposely dying from the get-go. So the other guy can have someone spectate cam for him. I got re no real problem, I suppose. Like, it does give them an advantage that everyone else doesn't have, so I think it's bullcrap. Go play teams if you want to play teams. Um, but what makes it even worse is if one of them is coming in to purposely die. Probably um, feed his kill to the other guy so he gets a kill. Yeah, this guy saw me. And then spectate cam. For your friend, I think that that is a load of crap, and it's a shame that people do that. He was strafing like he was looking for a kill. He's not trying to strafe to that building. You see him strafing, looking in my exact direction. So what I'm going to do is I'm not exit camping. I'm going to use this information. I'm going to use a game mechanic for information. I want to know if this guy's going to push me. So I'm going to use... No, don't leave. We're going to use some crow sound. There's nothing over here, so no, no one's going to try and exit here. I'm not exit camping. I'm information getting... I want to know if that guy's going to push over here and get me, or if he was just looking to loot. That's it. That's what I'm doing. Someone got a little uh, red crate already. Man, they've been rare for me lately. Okay, I think he was just sprint strafing to the house. Like I said, I knew someone spawned up there somewhere. He was like, this must have spawned right here. I don't know. I sprinted all the way across there and he was sprint strafing from up here. 
Uh, look, how do you sprint strafe like that? He had his gun out, and he's sprinting like this. Now he just crouched sprint strafing. It, was, it had to be an adrenaline shot. Right, his adrenaline shot. Am I moving as fast as he was right there? Probably. Not moving as fast as my mouth is lately. Beep 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 a rocket gives you back your BB bounce. Um Yeah, that loot container makes me nervous heading that way. All that's in the damn wall is com stations. So annoying though that I can't even spawn. Like what I was what here? I can't even run up of here and go to the nearest loot spot without somebody somehow or <laughs> Already be in there. I reckon I just stay. Oh, he's, he might rotate this way. He could be rotating this way. I thought I'd just push back there and just. I don't know, man. No, look. You know where he's at. Don't head towards him. He might be heading this way. Is this store log rotten? This is store log rotten, right? Someone's here. Damn it. It's got to be a green coat. Only a green coat would come up here and me. <laughs> he heard me. He 100% heard me. I think he's hunkering down. Definitely a green coat. That is... That is at the uh, shipping container. Dude, just bugger off. I'll let you go. Just leave. I don't want to leave first because you might shoot me in the back. So if you just leave, it's all good. Be nice if you could talk to people. The added element that Tarkov has, which I wish I could play it for that reason. If you could just have a com little conversation, make a little deal with people. Yeah, they're probably going to kill you anyway, but... I don't like... Okay, I'll go, okay? Just don't freaking shoot me in the back. That guy's going to come up the hill and kill you anyway, so... Don't hang around too long. Well, that's where I was going to go. Now I can't. Push back that way? I don't know, man. There's going to be nothing down here but danger. I think I do head back north now. That guy probably looted up and he's coming through the middle. This guy's being very quiet. I don't like my spawn. I think I just leave. This is like, um, it's a waste of time. I told you. He got rolled up on by that other bloke. Looking for me. I knew it, man. Some didn't feel right. I knew that guy was going to push down this way. Well, now I have that information, I might just head back. Might just head back. He might not have looted this area. He might have just slowly made his way over there looking to kill me. Am 
unless that was whoever hit the locked container trying to come this way to get out. Which is a possibility. I'm still going to say it was this guy. I'm sure he's not sitting over here exit camping this whole bloody time. The plane is coming. Prepare to fight for the airdrop. Because, um... Like I said, I haven't spawned up near this in ages, and I thought, you beauty, I'm going to get a bunch of loot, but he must have spawned right bloody here. Right next to the house. There's only one reason why that's there. So whoever was in here didn't need it because they already found another one. Damn. Yeah, he looted it. Maybe not. Metal bits. Forgot. That's what we're here for. Are you still here? No? No, surely you'll loot if you're still here. That bastard did hit, he was stalking me. And got the other guy by mistake. Grab the little spud. People gotta stop leaving their spuds in the baby's crib. Did he come back this way? That's the question. Get out the win- No, that one- Fine. You don't want to get out that window. You can jump out this one then. Use this bandage. That's that one done. a jackpot. Right, come here if you need fertilizer. If you can ever get a spawn over here that is. Oh, let's lay down in the garden bed here. Take a nap. Let's see what we're going to do next. No point pushing anything else now. I go into that damn wall, I'm going to die trying to get out of there. Let's check along the road there, there was some vehicles, which I thought was an exit over here because of that, but it's not. Weird, this should be an exit. I think I've been here once. Long, 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 early on days, time ago. I heard a troll, but I don't need him. No XP for you anymore, buddy. I mean, this would be a sniper spot for people on the dam. Right? Is there running across the dam wall? Metal parts, come on. There we go. Here we go. Trash. 
tractor or something up there. Yeah, we get out of here now. Let's use one of these. Yeah, I hit the shed already, didn't I? Nothing there. What have we got here? Nothing. Two random boxes. How far away is this exit? It's pretty close. I just wanted to look over here. Don't climb up there though, that's going to slow you down too much. Let's get out. Smarter about getting out before that radiation totally kills you, dude. Alright. Leave it till too late. Whew. Avoided the stalker. Strafe. Stalker me from the start. Looted up most of that house, I think. Bastard. But he definitely pushed over there, looking for me. And I, t I tried to warn the guy in the shack. I said, you stay there, someone's going to come and get you. I'm going to leave you alone, but you stay there, someone's going to come and get you. He didn't listen. Got some more face paint. Legacy season warlords level 14. Ah, oh, postman's been on my property again. Keep telling him to send this fire a different means. Wide stripe camo face paint. Not really my style. Stop pointing at the sky. It looks like he's uh Frost nip is going away. So I've got another few levels to go to get these crowns. Then I might as well just push for level 22 to get that one. Before we pick a different one that's got a plan I want. Let's check the dailies. See if Ada has uh, sent me any rewards by the post as well. I don't know. See, she she does the right thing. Don't be coming on my property, right? I, I don't know how she does it. Probably via airmail, pigeon. I don't know. <laughs> so I got twenty fertilizer. That's a big pigeon. Bring your twenty fertilizer. That's a wrap. One more pill, and two hundred more metal parts. Hmm. Where would I go for metal? Ooh, Vic Dawson. But in a snow decks there, but like I said, no thank you. No thank you. We're going to Vic Dawson, that's where you're going to find metal parts. I mean, I do like Fisk. Sometimes it's kind to me, uh, most of the time it's not. But we're going to Vic Dawson. I did all the pills, right? Do I have to go one more pill? One more pill. One more pill. Alright, then you need to cut back a bit. Alright, you're popping too many pills. You're going to get addicted. You're going to be on ups and downs. You're not going to wake up one day. It's, it's going to happen. Yeah. Look at Heath Ledger. You don't want to be the next Heath Ledger. You don't want to be the next Michael Jackson. Can't be getting addicted to these painkillers. 
Uh, hell, I'll take an iodine tablet in case I want to hang around for a bit longer. And the gem, might as well, as long as I can cra keep crafting them, I'll keep taking them. Alright. Big Dawson. Let's see if we can uh, get rid of this frost nip. Vic Dawson. If Romero can't find the metal parts of Vic Dawson, it might be time to tell him to find another place. He seems to be wasting our time more and more. I mean, he is useful for our love. Dude. Is that the same guy that was in the last one? He hasn't brought his buddy with him this time. America! Temp 18591271261. Kill a thousand outlanders. What is that? Why do people have temp in their name? Um, is that because they're devs? Like they're people testing the game and they just have temporary names? Did he have a name that wasn't suitable and it was removed and replaced with temp? <laughs> Uh, where am I? Oh, are you serious? I know there's another spawn like right on the other side of this, isn't there? This, there could be a shootout happening right here between me and Mr. Temp. Wouldn't be surprised. I oh, know the other spawn's just over the hill there. Don't be running at me, Temp. Oh, shiz. Oh, you can have a bud. I swear that was Mr. Temp. I don't need a temporary bullet in the head that I have to remove later, so... I think he just yelled back. Like, that is so ridiculous, man. You can't even sprint. And I mean sprint. I suppose it didn't have an adrenaline shot to the first spot where you spawn. That somebody pointing a gun in your face. Don't you get shot in the back here, you idiot. Why are you climbing in here? He's not... Notice he hasn't pushed the signal thingy yet. He's nervous too. Unless he's just trying to find me first. Oh, there we go. Hey, bud, I'm over here. I'll see you later. It's all good. You can have it. I would have liked to have hit that loot area up, but uh, the Outlands don't seem to like us to have a little loot spot to ourselves. So I'm going to go over here. Happy looting. And um, probably run into the guy pushing down from the rest area. We come here for metal parts, okay? Which could be in the forest cabin. I've already sprinted too far away from that now. I need to come through the centre of town. Um, man, I don't know now. Kind of rule my day, dude. You kind of, you kind of put a dampener on things. I like to come out alive, even if I come out with nothing. It's just that's what I like to do. Treat it like it's a real game of survival. Where your life actually means something. And even if you come out with nothing, at least you come out alive. I mean, yeah, it's fun to be lucky. If he dies, he dies. But ultimately, I never really mean it. If you haven't noticed. If he dies, he dies. I still, when I go in with that mentality, I still can't sprint to the nearest thing and take it on the chin. If he gets stuck rock, he gets stuck on rock. 
can do plenty of that. Should be some metal parts just up there. Around them cars. Maybe just here. I was watching back one of my videos yesterday. I was in Felcanton. In uh, that spot underground that has the two dummy caches you can dig up. Anyway. I had one of those red crates there which I always find are locked. Not locked. Already looted. Or empty. Oh, hello. Anyway, I pulled like an adrenaline shot, radiation grenade, um, like high value goodies out of one of those. But usually whenever I find them, they look just like that. If you can find one of those that uh, is shut, open it. Tell me if it has high value stuff in it. And my dog's just talking to my daughter, so you're going to hear some yapping, maybe in the background. From uh, the dog, not her. She's not much of a talker. She's like me. When I'm not on here, I'm not much of a talker. Can you believe it? I think someone's been here. Maybe they've already gone. I don't know. Maybe they're already gone. I don't know. Surely they would have set off a car alarm, right? Or they've got more self-control than me, and they don't open the cars. I can't help myself. Well, maybe he didn't hey back. It was an owl. It sounded just... There it is again. I think it was an owl saying hello. Not that dude. <laughs> oh, now I'm going to say hey. No, not with that one. Maybe one of these other ones. No, not that one either. I'm going to use this before someone kills me. I just got a feeling. There we go. Jammer in a car? You mean I could be searching jammers for cars? No, the other way around. Are you cars for jammers? Okay. That's weird. It's just snow falling out of the tree. Okay, it's not someone up here in the tree. Imagine walking into a tree and you sort of you go like this and someone's standing right <laughs> right there. That'd be pretty funny. I need metal bits. I'm gonna go up here through the road up this way to the east. Which sometimes I call the west because I get turned around. And maybe, just maybe, find some over here. Dude, please change that sound effect back to the way it was. Hello! Is that two? I just set off two in the one spot. Droppy schmear droppy. Let's uh hmm. I only found 16 metal bits. There's a high demand for these things lately. It seems like every bloody day Ada wants me to go find some metal parts. But uh 
thankfully any spare ones on that day she lets me keep so I can put them to good use I don't like the idea of sprinting across there in the open sometimes you just got to do what you don't want to do Conductors light up too, I have not found yet. Just in case. No, don't ring that. Open that. There's some metal bits. Okay, way too now, disruptor. Maybe I hit this stuff. It's kind of near these things though. That's a weird landing spot for the airdrop. If that guy's still over there, he can have that. Freaking rock. He's definitely going to get me killed one of these days. Okay, now I've got to slow down a bit. Coming up on a more dangerous location. Mr. Sprinty today, I tell you. Not messing around. Open door. We have an open door. Probably opened a long time ago. Right. We have another open door. Why two open door, no three open door? Why two open door, no three open door? I didn't hit the shed, obviously. Someone's going to pop a signal detector to see if anyone's still around. And uh, I want to follow that plan. Ah, uh, could have went and used that, I suppose. <laughs> I can craft more of them. <sighs> That's going to be exit. Anyone hitting this stuff late's going to use. What I don't like is if there's not one person camping one of them, there's going to be someone camping the other one, and they're right bloody next to each other. That I don't like. Someone's probably camping that. So... I don't think it's safe to go that way. You either got someone camping these, or you got someone camping here. I've got a uh, radiation pill. I can hang around for a bit. Radiation is about to hit. One radiation pill isn't going to cover it. I think we just leave. Just leave north through that one. I don't like the idea of going up that way. There's the time safe. 
So they're hitting it because they know they've got to hit it. They're probably going to run south. Let them have their goodies. There's someone. I told you someone would be camping it. Am I gonna get to this one up here or should I be going the other one? Oh, you're closer to it now. Keep going. There's nothing... there's nothing in there. That was weird. Oh, this is the railway tunnel one, isn't it? I've got to go down this way. Come on, don't this jankiness get me killed. Okay. There we go. Haven't done that one before. Look, I've left here after someone else has opened it. Let's get out. Oh, I thought that was a loop there. <laughs> Let's get out. What if there's loot at the end of the train car? Like something really good. Let's go have a look. Got some metal bits. I've got to get 25 of them. It's just not going to cut it. I need more. Okay, check off another daily. I mean, Ada can't be too unhappy. Got two checked off. Now we're just going to try and get 400 metal parts completed for her. And we'll call it a day. I say, I head straight back to Vic Dawson. Might actually change this hat though. I don't like the way the wind was sort of, you know, you wear a hoodie sometimes and the wind blows in, like if it's really windy, and it, the wind is blowing into your face and your hood catches all that cold wind. Yeah, that's what was happening. So I'm going to whack on some different headwear. I like my old watch cap. I just do. I don't know why you would want to wear your little boonie hat. Oh, you got a string there to hold it onto your head, I suppose, but... Nah. Wear this. Won't catch that cold air into the hood and funnel it down my jacket as much. Oh, this is probably the gun they were talking about here. AKM, because it's common parts. I've got six of them. It does 35 damage. 35... 600, 715. 35, 600, 715. This one's only 23. 700, 730. Yeah. Base damage is better on this AKM. 35, 600, 715. This one's got better... What is that? Muzzle speed and fire rate? But the base damage on the AKM is is better. I mean, what's better? F muzzle speed and fire rate? Um, or base damage? I love, uh, now I know, yeah, they're, they're quite common, apparently. Common assault rifle. I've got six of them. I can take in that one more often. As well. I just, uh, something about a shotgun though, I do like a shotgun uh, and I have gotten some kills with the silver pigeon I wish there was some sort of stat track on them Dawson Station 
just so you knew how many kills you'd gotten with each weapon. What was your favourite weapon? What was your preferred weapon? That would be nice. Um, I know I've got a little, like, a shorty shotgun that has gotten me a, a couple. If I had more of the pump action ones, I would uh, take in those. I'm scared I'm going to lose it because I don't have many of them. What is it with the oh, people rocking kill badges today that want to come in pretending to be green coats? Just a friendly little green coat. Don't mind me. Yes, sir. Toodle doodles. 666. I've seen that guy around before. <sighs> okay. We've got a couple of, yeah, three real green coats coming in for scav runs. Revic Dawson, bottom end of the map, please. Just bottom end of the map so I can get some uh, metal bits. Bloody hell. Eardrums. No. Stop trying to tempt me with loot containers, okay? I want to be over here. I'll sprint to that. Someone's going to get there coming from this way. They're going to kill me before I can open that bloody thing. Keep that to yourself. I'm going this way. That was a pretty green looking lobby, but uh, not green enough. Nice and uh, white out conditions here. I like it. I let the cold air in. Blow up your skirt. Yeah, the skirt you're wearing. Wearing a. Ooh, ooh, kind of near the signal detector though. I'll think about it. I'll think about it. Can I climb this? Probably not, right? It's a bit steep. Need these metal bits. I was a dig up a dummy one on the way to a real one. I'm not opening that. Where is that dude? Okay. Open this from the back. Come at it from behind. If you don't know, you can actually come at those from behind. A little sneaky little trick. Railway, train conductor, lighter. I have not been through this area very often. Would it be on a train? Maybe. Not in a building. Is the train conductor? It might be on the bloody train. Like that train there looks like a... You no, know, that's the engine. That's where the conductor's gonna be. Or is, no, that's the train driver. Get it right. Your conductor is actually sitting somewhere else. Oh, hang on a second. No one might be in there. 
Don't mind the guy walking along next to the train, okay? Maybe this is his house. This is where the train conductor lives. Well, here's one of the, here's a, here's a test. Yeah. Damn it, man. Look at one of those. But so these have, um, rarer loot in them. The guy is in one of these buildings. looking for attention. You know what they need to make more uh, plentiful on the map is those bloody adrenaline shots. <laughs> I, I realised what I was saying as, as I was saying it. Like, no, don't. I like, because there's a challenge where you got to use five in one thing and you can only bring in three, so you got to find them on the map, but they're hard to find. But um, then those that like to sprint around with them are just going to do that even more than they already do. Kind of wanted to go north and hit those buildings. But uh, there's a Mr. Shooty out there. Did I bring in my bandage? I did. Cool. Now I don't feel bad about doing that. Could even be in that house right there. Slowly working his way down. It's a trap. It's a trap. It's a trap. Pick up your little wintry apples and move along. train conductor. Where would you leave your lighter? I just found two adrenaline shots. If I had three on me. Okay, I kind of don't want anybody knowing I'm here. How big is this house? I hear a vinyl. I have not found all of these bloody suckers yet. Okay, that's new. That's three cash keys. How many spawn on a map? 20. I need this vinyl. The plane is coming. Prepare to fight for the airdrop. I am pretty sure... I don't have this one. Shattered. I don't... No. I might already have that one. Do I try and come across here right next to the signal detector to get a friggin' cache? That 
the number of cash keys that spawn on this bloody map, or any map, that has a lot of buildings. Someone's probably already got it. Someone's going to be over here anyway, I reckon. Trying to dig that up right in sight of the signal detector. Pushing back north, someone's there. Someone grabbed an airdrop and left. I think I could probably head this way, depending on where that crate lands. I want it to land sort of up here. You son of a f Okay, well now I can't go that way. Unless I... Oh, someone picked... Okay, someone moved the location of it. Like that guy said in my chat. So you can see the exact landing spot. Notice, that's how it disappears so quick. When people... So he's moved it and stealthed it. And that's how they disappear so quick. They hit the ground and someone grabbed them. And go. Someone grab him and go. Question is, which way is he freaking going? Someone's hit the time switch. Maybe it's safe to grab the cash. Stand out in the open near the signal detector. I'm here for metal bits, okay? That's what we're here for. Okay, he's flicked the switches. Am I going to hear gunfire? From somebody trying to kill him? That's the question. Okay, he's got it open. I can't believe no one is touching that bloody uh, signal detector right now. I used my bloody pill. Train conductor, eh? Get on the bloody... Dude, why can't you climb up there? Are you serious? I don't want your thing, okay? I'm here to get other stuff. Move along, wherever you are, and stay away from that location. You do, you all do me. We'll be as happy as we can be. Just leave the apple tree out of it. Conductor's lighter. Oh, that crappy wire in it. It's very uh, spooky sounding down here. They don't always have great loot in them, those things. There's a car park outside there, down stairs. The, the conductor is on the train, right? So it's got to be on one of the trains. Let's get some info. I've got to run to an exit. I've got to go now. That's probably my safest bet.
like a wood gutter. There is one right there, but I don't like the idea of heading to that one. I'm in a jammed area. Are you serious? Right there, there's a jammer. Spot the camp. This is the janky exit. That I don't know how to get out, out of. Is it up here? Ah, oh, there's a little door there. Okay, now I know. Now I know how that works. I thought this was the one that would have been camped, but I, that jammer sitting up there made me nervous, like he was putting that there in case anybody signal detected to see if it was safe to exit there. I mean, when someone leaves a map, the jammer should... <laughs> Like it should, um, it should get destroyed. Because he could have left. Alright, is this vinyl one I don't have? We will find when uh, I load back into the homestead if there's music playing. It's a new one. Metal Bits 57. Eh. Is it? New. Need to hear music right here. It mustn't be. There it is. I like it. Very fitting for the map it was on. That's enough of that madness. <laughs> it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Uh, clicking dislike on it does not mean I dislike it. It just means I don't want to play it every time I come out of the uh, encounters. Just in case they're DMCA'd. So I hope I don't cop, cop one there. Cool little uh, folk square dancing, violin, cellos. Uh, I don't know. Kind of reminds me of the um, Last of Us 2. There's a song like that that plays. Metal bits. Still need more metal bits, damn it. Brodolin? Or Deverg? I've already got the snow gear on. I think I'll go Deverg. There's a couple of bits of the map I know, and plus, it might be a bit friendlier there now. Are you kidding? He went and fixed the phone lines yesterday, and now some of the uh, people that wanted out of that town have left. They were able to contact people to come and pick them up. Okay, alright. They're probably not going to be happy to see me. So it's going to be risky. What am I talking about? I mean, is this entertaining? Is it is it entertaining to listen to somebody lose their mind and tell uh, stories? Um, put that away. I swear I popped one to get out of there, didn't I? So we just need the metal bits now. We're getting close. The 
Burg it is. It's way hidden. Got my nice warm leathery gloves on. I do have the the white wintry ones. Probably gonna be a bit more camouflaged with those. These ones are nice and warm though. Warm looking, you know what I mean? <laughs> Losing my mind. Deverg. Hopefully the elders don't shoot as soon as they see me. Gotta realize that not everyone wants to be part of this community. Gene Paul's getting a bit too thick. I bought in a slightly bigger backpack too. And I need the rest of these metal bits. So I thought I might change my luck. Only problem is I um forgot something. got a jammer. Let's hope that doesn't get me killed. TTV buzzkill. So he's a buzzkill because he's in here looking to kill people and then therefore kill their buzz. Let's hope not. Let's hope not. A baked cookie. I can tell by the hat. The hat and the turtleneck gave that away. Come on. Hmm, south or north? St head straight north or into whoever spawned down that end? I'm going to head to Olaf's farm and hope he's got some metal bits that he doesn't need. Because uh, last time I was at Olaf's farm, he was, he was friendlier than the rest of the folk in the centre of town. Not a bad bloke or Olaf. Oh, great, mysterious. See, look, what did I say? I said that freaking forgetting that jammer would get me killed. Oh, good. Someone used it. So he portabled to see if anyone was around to see if it was safe enough to use the disruptor. That's weird. I thought I was in range of the freaking disruptor. How was I pinged just now? Oh, I don't like this. going on right now man. I don't like it so I'm gonna push out. Use a portable a portable pings me then and then someone uses the disruptor. The disruptor goes away. Uh, he shots over that way. What a load of crap, man. Is he even damaged? Look, he's not even damaged. I put shots into him, and then he pops me with a Rafika pistol. What a load of crap. What a load of crap. He sprints straight up around the edge. I get shots on him first. Did he have a... Did he have a... Did he have... 
an armor plate. I didn't hear a ching when I destroyed it. I should have let him run past, although I think he knew where I was. This guy's sus. I'm gonna watch this guy for a second. I just want to. I want to see something. I don't know. That was just weird. Maybe he was just. He thought, right? He's in that building. I'm gonna avoid him. But the Rafika pistol takes me out. You see how quickly I die if I don't put someone down straight away. They shoot me and I'm dead. Instantly. Instant kill. It's not like, oh, I take a couple of shots. No, I'm dead instantly. If I don't put someone down straight away, like they seem to be able to do to me, I'm dead. That was too close to that rock, and so I was worried about it blocking my bullets. I should have stood up and got shots on him instead of being crouched down next to the behind the near the rock in case that blocked any of my shots. But still look at his health. He must have had a health like an armor plate, surely. And I removed it. Or it's just my ping. By the time my bullets get to him, he's already up on the rock above me and shooting me dead. I don't know. I'd love to know what it looked like from his point of view. Like a death cam. Instead of this spectating cam crap, have a death cam that shows me the like last 15 seconds before my death. And then like the next 5 seconds after it. Just to sort of see what I looked like from his point of view. Because I could have been... What the... He left. He left. He left the raid. Mr. Kill Someone with one shot with a Rafika left. Is, I must have took his armor plate and he didn't want to hang around without one. Okay, that's weird. Alright. <laughs> that's bloody weird. I think he was just trying to avoid the building because he knew I was in there. And then... Because of my ping, because of my crappy ass ping, I died. Yeah, is what it is. Let's go to the next one. Why didn't you hang around, buddy? The jock strap on your face was starting to get a bit manky. The um, panty liners on your eyes starting to stick to your eyelids. Okay, fair enough. I just, I, you killed me so easily with that bloody Rafika. Like, I, I can't kill anybody with that thing. I've only tried a couple of times, but... I thought for sure you were some psycho killer. But you didn't want to hang around near the wash, the face gear. Okay. You got me, bud. You got me. Oh, you can look at their stats now, too, which is kind of cool. So he's no... Look, he's got 11 airdrops um, so I'm actually better with airdrops hmm. so he's, he's not a collector of airdrops or red crates he's, he's got 81 kills and 38 headshots so he headshotted me with that thing just locked onto my head I should have smelled him coming with that jockstrap man I should have smelled him coming it's my fault like I heard him coming, but not until he was right on top of me, and I'm like, oh crap. Maybe I was um, upwind. I needed to be downwind, and I might have smelled him coming from further away. Damn, man. Right. No, 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 no. Let's try out this. Um... I might try out the AKM. No, that's. We need assault rifles. Let's try it out. Try out one of these. Bring in a jammer this time. I just don't know why the disruptive signal was used right. And it lasted all of like 10 seconds. That was weird. 
So I thought, oh, it's alright, someone's using the disruptor. Oh, did I queue? I didn't queue. Deberg. And then screw this, I'm taking in my largest backpack. I need the rest of these parts and I need them now. So where is it? What am I looking for? Not that one. Not that one. Patrol pack. Give me that big boy. the size of that one. Give it to me. I'm taking it in. Get the rest of these metal bits. Don't need many. 118. 118. Got it done. Dude, there's a bit of smoke coming out of there. I think it... Yeah, no, that's not good. You need to clean that chimney when you get back to... Might be a bit blocked. Try and get up on the roof. Give it a clean. <laughs> you know what? I said at the start of the day when I saw the daily challenge for collecting the metal parts. Didn't I just do this yesterday? And I don't even know if it was. Because... The, my problem is I'm I'm editing footage and uploading videos that are that are from like 15 20 days ago video recorded stuff from the, from like a fortnight ago and the last one I uploaded was about collecting a bunch of metal parts and I just called the video heavy metal because I'm running around with a heavy load of metal anyway it was probably that so I'm losing track of uh, what I did yesterday in the game versus what I did two weeks ago that I'm editing so that I can upload. I'm losing track of what day I actually did stuff. So I need to try and catch up. This is hard. I'm trying to edit it together. If I've got a two hour long video, it takes a couple of hours to upload. It takes at least an hour to um, go through the footage and Make sure it's right and ready to go. Deberg Forest. Um, it's, yeah. It's very time consuming <laughs> to try and get the, the videos up to catch up. Maybe I need to start taking a day's break. Day on of playing the game and then a day of uh, doing the footage to upload and uploading it. I was kind of wanted to do like, you know, every day. Daily challenges, especially to get the uh, legacy seasons done. It's just hard to catch up. Anyway. Who was the guy that killed me just then? Nah, he was like, he had snow gear on. I don't think it was any of these dudes. I just can't believe he left. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Where am I? Sprint for the locked container? Nah, someone's probably spawned center of town. I've gotten that uh, spawn again. We're here for metal bits, not locked containers, okay? It does look tasty. You gotta open three locks in the bloody thing, you're gonna get shot in the head 100%. Stop thinking about it. Alright? No. Not here for glass. Unfortunately. Oh, sometimes there's one down there. I want to start here in lots of gunfire in that direction. I want to start here in mortar strikes. Oh, 
nothing? Really? Someone's just opening it very quietly. That's the barred house. No one just like the look of where this spawned. It's on the road. Someone's got to have eyes on it now, right, with a sniper rifle from up above. I didn't bring in a jammer, did I? I did. If you didn't sprint for it now, there's no point really trying to get it. Someone's camping it. Forest dump. No. There's a map location called Forest Dump. <laughs> I've probably seen that before and just never thought it was funny. I didn't realise it could be a play on words. I was just like, oh yeah, that's the forest dump. And which tree is someone else sitting in right now? Yeah. I should have sprinted straight to it. Now now this is just uh this is silliness. I'm trying to get it I'm trying to get that now is just not it's so quiet. Jam I blocked a signal so someone's here to see if anyone else is around. Oh but they probably just use that. I can't even see it from where I'm sitting, which I don't understand how I can't see the bloody thing. It's sitting right there. Yeah, this is just silly. We need to go. Can we die to somebody who's got more experience with this than you? Just get out of there. We're here for metal bits. Not here to get the SHITSs. Just a green coat. Let them go. He's just a little looter. He's looting up my forest dump though, damn it. Let him have it. Okay, well. Now what? It's gonna go north. No one snipe me, please. I'm not the guy that looted the, that thing, okay? I probably could have been, but... It seems like it took forever for someone else to get over there. A lot 
longer than I thought it would have taken. I did enough enough killing yesterday. Okay. Did enough killing yesterday. Today is the day of... Or oh, did I kill someone earlier today too? I can't remember. I think I did. someone laying up here looking to snipe that direction. I don't think he could hear me saying Ey! over the uh, the wind and this mask I'm wearing. Someone's got to be sitting in that house, right? Got to be. Is he really still sitting there? Maybe he already hit the looted container, unlocked it quietly, and then went over here and used that? Or he's been camping it the whole time, wondering why no one was coming for it, and I'm over there in the tree. So he thought, I'll go use the signal detector and see where everyone's at. It's right out in the middle. If anyone's going to push that now, go do it so I can check this house. metal bits is that light oh that's the old yeah the tomato one I've found that a ton of times cash key no. I don't know if anyone's going to touch that. Sitting in a weird spot. Up the hill. XP, but um, hmm. I don't have to actually. Jeez, sound just went all janky. I don't have to actually get out with the metal parts I've looted. That guy just must have sat on that loot container and he's just camped it the whole time. Someone's going for it. He can have it. Little green guy. You're welcome, buddy. That's the same guy, look at, I think, from the forest dump. I shall name him Forrest. Good luck to you, pal. Oh, he's about to die. It 
Someone found one down here too, right at the same time. No, he's getting out. He's getting out. Just don't camp that exit and kill me, you bastard, after I let you live right there. I could have had you twice on the box and run into the exit. So just get out of here. Can you find red crates in loot containers? Because I see this here happen a lot. People running around with, um... Obviously, like, it's a drop. It's a red crate drop. But they seem to pick them up out of, uh... Loot containers. I mean, that's kind of a waste of a red crate. Now, I wonder I haven't been able to find them lately. If they've been sticking them inside those. So you've actually got to hit the freaking loot container to get one. I should be leaving. should be doing. Oh, I can run across here. Cool. Thought I was going to have to run around the entire bloody lake. See, I'm a nice guy. I could have easily shot that dude as he was getting the airdrop. And then he ran straight past me. I could have had him twice. There was a daily today for killing people with assault rifles. <laughs> would I have had the same control? Or would I have went, ooh, or a daily for headshots? Like he's crouched down there on the airdrop. How many metal bits did I get? None. Bloody hell. Romero! You're out there for metal parts, buddy. Don't spend time wasting time laying under trees wondering whether you should loot a container or not. Okay? Metal parts. Stay focused. It says I just unlocked a new title for called Traveller. Um which wearing that backpack you kinda of do look like a traveller. Kill have I, I've killed twenty five people. I don't need to see that. I don't need to see that. <laughs> okay. I don't want to see that. Uh, wait, travel 500 kilometers. Okay. You need metal bits, alright? Let's get back out there. Let's go Sagbrook. Stay focused. If you're going to carry a knife, take in a decent one, okay? I reckon they've improved melee. I don't know, um, you never get close to enough to anyone. Maybe, look, if I had a knife against that dude that shot me standing on top of the rock, that would have been the perfect time to whip out a knife and uh, try and get him. I'll take in a falcon knife. Falcon knife. Let's go get these metal bits. All, I don't even need to look. 112 of them because you didn't get any that time. Sorry, 118. My mistake. Your math was off. Oh, crap. It's about to get changed. The pickup's here early. Damn it. Didn't even give me time to get changed. So we're heading into Sagbrook with our Arctic gear on. Ah, that's right. 
I forgot you can, um, I was reading the little tips there as we were waiting for a lobby. I forgot you can shoot off or blow off the barricades for the bard house now. I forgot all about that. I did that a couple of times when I remembered a few days ago. Lay down a contact bomb, shoot it. That's my uh, preferred method. I forgot you could do that. Don't waste ammo on it. Unless you got a ton. I was taking in contact bombs and doing it that way. Did I get booted? Oh no, I'm still there. Yeah, contact bomb. Lay it down, boom, shoot it. Very quick way to get into a bard house. Okay, we're in here with look, Sergeant Slaughter, 2k. He's killed 2,500 Outlanders. I'm guessing that's what that is, right? Or is that 5,000? So, I need to hit this. That's what I need to do, and then get away from there before this guy comes out and comes after me. Hopefully no one's spawned next to it. They might have. So I've just got to be a bit careful. Because so I just realised that a blue box... Seriously, dude. Seriously. A uh, blue box from there or two would be nice for these metal parts that I need. Uh, guaranteed whoever used that because they spawned right on top of it is the uh, guy that's looking to kill everybody and he just went oh wow cool and he's all excited I like this spawn now where is everybody bastard all right who's up here where are you going I don't know I ran a bit too far <laughs> maybe that's a sign Maybe I should be leaving right now. It's not what I want. We come here for metal bits, so we'll probably only find nails. Someone's upstairs. Damn it. Just jump. She jumped off. Is it a green coat? Looted it all up. And they've bolted away. Okay. They ran off in a hurry. Did they hit the shed? It mustn't have been in a combination locked box on the balcony. Damn, she hit the shed already. Damn it. She's got some good loot. Maybe I'll follow her. She got everything, man. Except the, the one on the stairs. I don't know if that's someone else rotating around here to kill. Or if that's her deciding she should leave. Sound like somebody else was here. You, you idiot wearing that backpack. Look at me, everybody! I was going to go back across and then push down. And look at that for a spawn. Too, for that thing. Is there a spawn location right here? I see that loot container sit there so often. Well, there is there. So someone just has to go pop, signal detector, sprint down, grab that leaf. <laughs> Did this person leave or are they still hanging around? My only option now is to hit the north side. Did 
try and get some loot. She got all that. She cleaned it out. her down. She could be hunting me for all I know. Now she's leaving. I think she said she's gone up this way to look for more stuff and got flushed back down here by someone else. Damn it man. Probably a cache. I bet you she found a cache key and there was a buried cache in the middle of the forest clearing. She headed there and grabbed it. Got all my loot. I mean, I could have. Okay, there's another one. There's another one I could have killed. And had this metal parts challenge be done. I think I'm wasting time still being here. I need to leave. Because the dailies are about to end, and I need to get into another encounter. Hit all the stuff up north. Damn it, give me some metal parts, man. What are, are they, Luger? Got like 15 of them. Why can't I take those carrots? Hoping she can come up this way. Holy Jesus, what are you doing up here? Alright, just. There's cash that's already been hit by her, I'm betting. Loot things through walls. This is much needed metal bits. she try and come back this way? So this is the area I was hoping she hadn't touched. Loot Goblin number two. Fighting for loot with Loot Goblin number one. Which is me. I'm the King Loot Goblin. Don't kill me till I loot these three boxes here, please. Okay, kill me now. Okay, there's a tented area up here I'm going to try and get to. Not very well camouflaged, and I just realised why, because he's still wearing that stupid friggin' arc The plane is near. Get ready for the airdrop. It's not stupid if you want to go to the snowy maps, obviously. It's funny because when I first started playing this game, I was like, I need some arctic gear, I need some snowy camouflage for these maps to have snow. I didn't know they didn't even have it in the game yet. Now they just put it in. You missed one. Okay, there's another little spot over here. Oh, I've got to no, this. That's what I'm looking for. 
I think there's even another down power pole just over here. Even though it's not marked on the map. Here it is. It's just look like the Yeti walking through the freaking green forest. What works? This might give me what I need. Come on, metal pass, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. the destroyed dreams. Let's hope that's not uh, foretelling. I want to get that out just in case. Someone might be here hunting yetis. Where is the cache out of curiosity? Is it in the forest clearing? Yeah, she went there and picked that up. I was right. She found a cash key there, went and got that, turned around and left. I am learning this game. Slowly but surely. The looting side of it anyway. You'll never see me learn the uh, shooting side of it completely. I mean, maybe she didn't hit it. Let's go. Let's go back and see if I was right. I mean, like I said, I don't need to actually get out. I just have to loot metal bits. I want to know for sure if I was right. I think all the looters are gone. It's just the shooters now and this idiot here. So I should be okay running up all around this area. Although we did have Shooty McShooty was just down the hill there. Stuck on a bloody railing. Alright, if you're lurking around up here anywhere, bud, just let me test my theory, okay? I want to know for sure. Don't kill me yet. I want to know if I was right, if I read it right. Yeah, I can see it from here. I can see the empty container. Or is that a log? Maybe not. Yeah, there is. There's the empty container. Alright. I was alright. I can leave now. I can leave now. <sighs> Little Luke Goblin got there before me. There's two maps. Two Luke Goblins. Cobbling up stuff for me. Do I have enough time to get this daily done now? You do. Just, just move. Okay. Crash down. What we got? It's gonna be close. Gonna be close. I want to sprint to this exit. Maybe grab something on the way out. Here we go. Bit of food.
Help! I need metal parts. Oh yeah, I got 103 of them. Just so close. All right, quick. I don't know if I've got enough, gonna have time. I've got to get in, grab metal parts, get out. Got 20 minutes. This is definitely gonna be the last one. So I've got to make it quick. Painkillers might come in handy another day. Sag block's probably my best bet. Head back there. Get off this bloody heavy backpack though. Sagbrook. Let's run to the nearest thing that might give me metal parts and get out. Because I need to have time to get back to claim the reward from Ada before she says, no, sorry, too late, got some new ones for you. Not handing out rewards for those ones today. Same guys in here. That's only a thousand he's killed. <laughs> I'm going to fall short of my dailies because of my kindness. But oh well. What's a life worth? Metal parts. If your name is Mandy Mayhem, you're not in here to make friends. Oh yeah, I might even be able to find the metal parts I need along the along the uh, edge here. Come on, come on, this could be good. Come on. Damn, I'm not opening a car. There is a little beach area which I always forget to hit here somewhere. This isn't the area I thought it was. There's a little boat around here somewhere, isn't there? seen it on one of my previous videos. I swear there's a little boat down here somewhere. Oh, was an overturned trailer. There it is. I've done it. Dig up this dummy cache and let's go. Before you get shot in the head. Some chemicals. And you can leave. Job is complete. Sure, let's hit up a car on the way out. What could happen? <laughs> what could happen? They metal parts, there were metal parts right there. I was gonna check this spot first. Get out. Don't like the look of the dudes in this lobby. Let's get out of here. Are you trying to tempt me to stay with a cash key again? Oh, we've got to get back and collect these dailies. Cash is always the other side of the map, not always, but most of the time. And it is. Let's get out. Got what we needed. We got the metal bits. We can get out. We can collect that daily reward. And we're done. Just in time for me to go and cook some burgers. Yum yum. Got to get dinner ready for the family. Cook some burgers up. Alright, what do you got for me, Ada? Ten minutes to spare. So if I had uh, hung around for uh, too much longer in there, trying to get other loot before I left, one that I got back in time. Got the ones I wanted to get. Successful day. All right, that's gonna do it. Gotta go cook up some food and. Um, Do some chores.
do some farm villain around my actual home so this virtual one I'll see you in the outlands.